What's up guys, Courtney Cox here in the PNC Bank Sports Corner, joined now by Zach Cox because there's some breaking news in the Patriots world. Trent Brown is coming back to the Pats. The Pats sent the Raiders a 2022 fifth round pick for both Brown and a 2022 seventh round pick. First and foremost, Zach, are you surprised? Uh, a little bit, um, but not particularly once you kind of dive into the details of this deal. This is really a, a classic Patriots trade. Uh, they love these pick swaps and they love having players go get their money elsewhere and then end up coming back to New England. You saw it with Jamie Collins. You saw it with Dion Branch back in the day. Uh, and Trent Brown himself seems very excited to be back in New England. Uh, he always had great things to say about the Patriots, both during his time here and after he left. And judging by his uh, social media activity today, he is very excited to be back. Well, I do want to bring up that social media today because he signed a four-year, $66 million contract with the Raiders just two years ago. His social media, both on Instagram and Twitter, I can't really read exactly what he said on Twitter because we are uh, speaking on camera, but he's saying, you know, money isn't all that matters. Happiness matters. And this comes in a time where a lot of people are saying, you know, pay, playing for the Patriots seems to be the worst. That's not the, that's not the reality for Trent Brown. It certainly is not Trent Brown's reality. And he actually spoke about that right after he left the Patriots to sign with the Raiders back in 2019. He said he really loved everything about playing in New England. It was just a, a matter of money. He wanted to get that big contract. He was a seventh round draft pick, so he never had that, that sort of big time contract earlier in his career. Uh, and you can't begrudge a guy for going out and, and get the getting the money that he deserves. But yeah, two years later, it, it does seem like he is, uh, he's, placing fit over over money even though obviously this was not Trent Brown's decision this was a, a, a situation where the Raiders traded him back to New England and and now it's it's just going to be interesting to see how he fits back into this Patriots lineup because played left guard or left tackle rather at a very high level for the Patriots in 2018 won a Super Bowl with them uh, played right tackle with the Raiders also played right tackle earlier in his career with the 49ers uh, the Patriots have starters at both of those spots right now but either of them can be moved you could see Micah Wenu shift to uh to left guard from right tackle you could see Isaiah Wynn shift from left tackle to left guard a lot of moving parts on this Patriots offensive line which is probably going to lose Joe Tooney in free agency and it's going to be really interesting to see how Trent Brown fits back into this mix well for those at home that are forgetting uh Trent Brown is 6'8 350 plus pounds so how big of an asset is that alone for the Patriots? It, it's huge. I mean, Trent Brown is, is a very skilled pass protector, and he was really good in the run game in 2018, especially in that 2018 playoff run. Uh, the Patriots scored eight rushing touchdowns in that Super Bowl run. Six of them were run to Trent Brown's side. Obviously, they also had Rob Gronkowski and James Dillon leading the way on a lot of those runs. But for a Patriots team that was one of the better running teams in the NFL this past season, I had one of the stronger offensive lines overall. I think having Brown back in that mix will only strengthen that group. All right, well, there you have it from Zach Cox himself. We will keep, we will keep talking to you uh, as this story kind of develops and moves forward. Like I said, free agency is around the corner, so we will have a lot more to talk to you about uh, March 17th. It kicks off. So uh, keep it on Nesson.com as we continue this story and a lot more stories to come this offseason. And make sure to follow Zach on Twitter at Zach Cox Nesson. PNC Bank, helping to make banking easier.